Okay, I guess I'm going to show you how to make a copy of a Google Doc that has been shared with you. So, first thing you need to do is make sure uh, that you are logged in. So, if you have Google Chrome, uh, what you need to do is um, you could do notice that I'm not logged in yet, and so I need to log into Google Chrome. There's lots of ways to do that. I've chose the little um, app icon and I just selected a random Google app uh, I think I chose Gmail and so then I log in using my Google information which is my email account and here I have an email that was sent to me and in that email I happen to have a shared Google Doc and so when I click on the link I open up this Google Doc here but I don't want to hurt this Google Doc because it's shared with all of my colleagues so I'd like to make a copy of it so what I want to do is I want to go over here to the left and click on file and then the next step would be to click on make a copy so click file right here and then when it drops down I will click on make a copy now what that does is that allows me to make a copy of this original file but when it makes the copy it's going to save it onto my Google Drive leaving the original Google Doc intact um, if I edit this Google Doc, the original Google Doc, it'll mess everything up for everyone else. So once I click on make a copy, I get a prompt here. I can type in whatever name that I want. This little checkbox says I can share my new copy with everyone else that it was originally shared with. If I leave it blank, it just shares it with myself, which isn't much sharing. But either way, if I click on the OK button, my new copy will be saved to the Google Drive that I am logged into through whatever Google app I log in through. Since I use Gmail, it'll be that account. Once I do that, it takes a few seconds for Google to kind of process it and update my drive. Notice that the document looks exactly the same. However, in the upper left hand corner, I have the new document name. I have two tabs open, the original document that says official LMC letterhead and then the new document that says LMC letterhead. Now to verify or show that I actually have a separate document if I go over to the Google Apps icon which appears on Google Chrome if you're operating in Windows right here if I click on that little icon it will show the Google Apps that I have and that's saved to my Google Drive so I click on the Google Drive icon and I have a lot of stuff in my Google Drive, so if you scroll down somewhere in there, it should say LMC Letterhead. And there it is. And anytime I want to access that, I click on that link. Now this works for any Google document, uh, spreadsheets, anything that uh, Google has. So the exact same scenario, here I have a template of a shared Google spreadsheet. I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to share this with my students. So what I can do is I go over to file and then click make a copy, type in a new file name and it will save it on my Google Drive. So again I go over to file, click on make a copy. Here I could type in any name that I want. In fact I can type whatever I want and this document will go to my Google Drive. Remember though, whatever you type in this little box is going to be the file name. Uh, and that's also how you're going to find it in your Google Drive. And then you click OK. Gives it a few seconds for Google to think. And then, voila, I have a new copy in my Google Drive. And like I said, that'll work for Google Docs, Google Spreadsheets, Google Slides, any Google document that will work for.